our secondary, you know, it, it's the definition of basically our black hole defense. They run, they tackle, and they play football. And, uh, you know, they're going to play a lot of it. Bears secondary coach Jared Kite puts in the plan. The players put in the work. Uh, well, we just want to make sure it was high energy the whole practice and make sure there's no loafs or nobody just walking around looking at the ball being thrown or, you know, a ball on one side of the field and you just like act like the play is over. Like it's high intensity the whole practice, running to the ball, getting there, uh, making tackles, tagging off on the hip. And even during our individual drills, make sure everybody going through at high speed. You know, you don't just walk through your individual drills because that's going to show up when we get into our team reps. There are a couple of holes to the black hole because of graduations, but neither Coach Kite nor Manny Patterson expect a drop in performance. The safeties that we bring in, um, they have playing experience. Uh, Rich Carr, uh, Josh Huffman, who's played corner, slid back to safety, a leader for our defense, uh, and has had a really strong camp. Um, Rich Carr had three interceptions last year. And, uh, you know, Eric Robertson has been playing since a true freshman. We brought in Jerry Dadabo from Buffalo. So, you know, there's a lot of competition within the position. Last year we had two seniors in the group, and now we have another year with two seniors. And I feel like last year I loved our two seniors. So this year I, I really love, like, me and Huff together as the two leaders of the DBs. You can make sure all the young guys know their assignments. Everything is down packed. Make sure everybody's going hard. Even ourselves, we even get on each other anytime. Huff see me slacking, I see Huff slacking, we always get on each other. So I feel like it's definitely a sense of leadership within the DB group. One reason for the continued high expectations is having number one back there to make plays and set the example. Manny's a leader for our secondary, he's a leader for our defense. And, uh, you know, when Manny talks, people listen. You know, he's in there watching film. You know, a lot of the guys are in there watching film with him. And it's not just, you know, Manny working for himself. He's picking up, he's elevating the rest of the, the secondary and defense's play. And, uh, you know, he's grabbing these younger guys and watching film. And that's where we're going to excel is building each other up. And Manny's the, the forefront for that. It starts by leading by example. So you can always tell a young guy what to do. But if you're not doing what you're telling a young guy to do, he's really not going to take what you're saying serious. So it all comes with comes from leading from example and doing your part on the field. All of that equals what could be a special group of Bears. I think that we have the talent, um, we have the work ethic, and I think if we just uh, put everything together and we have the right guys on the field at the right times, they're going to make plays. And um, you know, I think we can be the best secondary in the country. I really do.